Well, right now I'm joined by Meg Roderer with the City of Flagstaff, who's here to update us on a little bit of what's happening within uh, the City of Flagstaff. Thanks for being here, Meg. Thanks for having me, Xavier. Of course. So I want to start off with the City Manager's Excellence Awards. I know this is something that happens every year. What can you tell us about it? Well, the City Manager's Excellence Awards, we have a deadline coming up of October 1st where we want to encourage the public to nominate the, an employee or department that's delivered exceptional service. And um, they're really happy with the performance, and they can get nomination forms online at our website. And so you say exceptional service. Is there anything specifically that this, you know, highlights? Yes, it does. It highlights service at a higher elevation, which is our <laughs> motto. And um, it also highlights the um, award with a Humphreys Award, an Agassiz Award, and a Fremont Award, all based off <laughs> our San Francisco peaks. Yeah, appropriately named yes. uh, <laughs> at a high, higher elevation, 7,000 feet about. Uh -huh. <laughs> um, so there's also a redesign in the works, and it's happening over the internet, right? What can you tell us about this? Well, it is happening on the internet. It's our website. So the <laughs> City of Flagstaff website, which is flagstaff.az.gov, is going to have a new look and feel this fiscal year. So we're really excited to roll that out and we're working diligently on that. And so I have to ask because I know people are wondering where is the funding for this coming from? Well we actually paid for that out of the budget in FY16 for implementation in FY17. Okay and so fiscal year 16 for implementation this fiscal year so yes. it's something that is actually already paid for right it's just being implemented now? Correct yeah so we're really excited to get all the um, now that the budget part is taken care of now <laughs> we can actually put the put yeah. it to work. Get the payoff. Yeah <laughs> exactly. <laughs> okay and um, also we have some train news happening that's actually going to bring some revenue to the city of Flagstaff. That's right. We have at our Flagstaff Visitor Center, we've just unveiled a new model train. It's a train that actually goes around the entire room. It's elevated, so when you go in, you can see the train track around the room. And uh, if you put a quarter in the kiosk, you can watch it go for about two minutes. And it's just a really fun new feature. And so we're excited to unveil that. All right. And I have to hit the money thing again. Where, where's the, those, all those quarters? Oh, that's a really good into. question. So that money will go back toward the Visitor Center for operations. So it's a great way to generate revenue and keep our visitor set center going strong. All right, well, I want to thank you for being here, Meg. Of course, for more information on the city of Flagstaff, you can go ahead and check out our website, naztoday.com.